Does your mom decorate every wall in your backyard differently as well? Welcome to Iranian Woman, where me and my mom get up to all kinds of things and take you along for the ride. As you may or may not remember, we recently made a fireplace in our backyard and we spent a lot of time decorating it. So we had this really pretty thing and then these very plain walls around it, so we decided that we wanted to decorate the walls to match the pretty fireplace. As always, Builder Guys started by making sure that the line we were going to put the wall on was straight. And then he started sticking the antique rocks until my mom joined him. Is my mom carrying a hose? What's that hose for? Like, is that the same one they use for the fireplace? And so my mom started sticking the antique rocks. She did this by putting some tile adhesive behind them and then sticking them to the wall. You might have noticed that there's an empty space on the second layer. That's because um, some of the rocks need to be cut in half so we can get the pattern that we want. Builder Guy will cut those and then he will add them like this. We got these rocks from a shop that specialized in these kind of rocks. Like they brought larger rocks and then they cut them to pieces in that shop. They had a really large variety of different kinds of rocks and we chose these for this wall and then we also chose some uh, river rocks for another section of the wall which we will show in another video. The rocks come in pairs so you have to open them like this and then start using them. Here you can see my mom trying to match them and see which way she wanted to put the rocks. The shop also had these same rocks in different colors. They had like a red version and a gray version. Those were really pretty as well. But these colors fit our house aesthetic a lot more. That's why we picked these. And this is not one color. They're like two different colors that we used for this wall. We matched these with the stone in our fireplace and now like the whole place has a theme of this color. So my mom didn't want to just place the rocks on the wall normally and get like a normal boring brick wall. So what she did was that every other layer, um, the layer would be one rock longer than the other and it would make the wall look like this piece of a jigsaw puzzle. Like it wasn't fully complete yet. And I think that's very cool. Now from here on out, I want you to remember that my mom wears green gloves. Not to signify her green thumb, but to cover up her fall themed nails. Now you might be asking yourself, why are the gloves so important? Well, my grandma has a history of uh, decapitating people with videos. Or, you know, just showing half of them. And uh, you're only going to see gloves from my mom. Those are her only remains. Alright, so by this point, the wall was as tall as my mom. They grew up so fast. But seriously, my mom was stretching to her full height at this point, And uh, we were going to need a ladder. So we brought in a chair. You ever have one of those like chairs or pieces of furniture that just have moved everywhere with you? This is one of those chairs. Like I literally remember growing up with this and I'm 22. point even the chair wasn't tall enough so they had to like set up a platform they could get on and work with and this is how they cut the tiles in half by the way and apparently it sounds really bad so my mom turned her face the other way to uh stop hearing because that's how hearing works apparently but no she was just afraid that like tiny parts of the tiles would get into her eyes and that, people, is how we decorated the wall behind our fireplace. Have you guys ever used antique rocks to decorate your walls? Tell us what it was like for you. 
I really hope you enjoyed this video, we have all kinds of wall designs in our channel, so you can check those out as well. Look at how happy she is to have finished decorating this wall. Also don't forget to subscribe to see more of what me and my mom get up to. I'll see you in the next video, bye!